What's up everyone, it's Jermaine with another Uber video, and in this video, I'm gonna try to compare and contrast Uber X drivers versus a trucker. If you don't know what I mean by a trucker, I'm talking about someone who drives like in a huge 18-wheeler, okay? So, let's just throw this out there. Okay, you take a trucker, someone who's a trucker, typically, they don't do it in their spare time, okay? This is something that they probably don't do for fun. If I'm a trucker, I'm not just going to go out on the weekends for fun and pick up a load or two. Okay? All right. Now, another thing about a trucker, too, is trucks cost a lot of money. Okay? They do. So, it's a large, a lot, very large investment up front. Another thing about truckers, usually, it really depends on the situation, but... If you're a contract trucker, you have to pay for a lot of expenses yourself, okay? But not all truckers are contract. Just like Uber drivers, truckers have to pay for expenses. But what really separates truckers from Uber drivers is this. In some markets, Uber drivers may make 90 cents a mile, okay? In 2015, the IRS says it costs 57 and a half cents a mile to operate a vehicle. So let's take one hour of that driver driving. How many miles could that driver drive in one hour? Okay, in a city. In San Francisco, if it's heavy traffic, you're not gonna be able to drive very far at all. Okay, in one whole hour, you may drive 10 miles, okay? 10 miles in one hour because of it's just gridlock traffic. Now, let's also throw into consideration there's surge pricing and there's also wait time to make the price increase, okay? Now, with a trucker, on the other hand, a trucker may drive 10 hours a day or 11 hours a day, but a trucker is probably going to be on the freeway moving at high rates of speed, meaning that he can drive more miles in an hour, okay? And also, a trucker... It's really hard to, to compare the two because if I'm a trucker and I get an assignment from a company, okay, I know that I have work on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, and on Thursday, okay? And if they tell me to drive from San Francisco to LA, I can calculate how much it's going to cost. I can calculate how much money I'm going to make. I can calculate how much gas I'm going to have to spend or diesel I'm going to have to spend. I can kind of figure out these things. With Uber, you get in your car and you don't even know where you're going to go. You may go two blocks away. You may go to LA. Yeah, you may go to LA. You, it, that's just how it is. Like, it's really hard to, to compare the two because they're, they're just not the same. Being a trucker, I mean, some truckers have unions. There's no fucking union for Uber. No, and, and it never will be. And it's not set up for Uber to have a union. I mean, talk about it all you want, but it's just not set up to be that way. Um, another thing with truckers, truckers, and another thing about truckers, if you take an 18-wheeler, okay, I don't exactly know how much they cost, let's say 100000 to $200,000, okay? How many miles can you put on that 18-wheeler, okay? How many miles can you put on it? You can put a whole bunch of miles on it, right? Take a Prius. How many miles can you put on a Prius? Maybe 200,000? You know, a trucker? Psh, more than a million? Now, it's really hard to compare those two because a freaking 18-wheeler costs a whole lot more than a Prius. An 18-wheeler is, you know, it's not as energy efficient, but is it? Because you can move so much more stuff in an 18-wheeler. It's just really hard to compare UberX drivers to an 18-wheeler. I mean, if I wanted to, I could compare an UberX driver to, you know, a bus driver. Once again, to be an Uber driver, you only have to have a heartbeat, okay? You only have to have a heartbeat you can't have any felonies. You can't have any DUIs. Oops, made a mistake on the video. You can have DUIs. You can have felonies. It's okay. 
and you need a somewhat decent car. It doesn't even have to be a nice car. It has to be a decent car, okay? Regular driver's license. And if you want, you can just drive down any normal street in any normal American city. And somewhere there's a gas station where there's people standing outside saying, Drive for Uber. We will give you $20 in free gas if you come sign up. Okay. Now, a trucker, on the other hand, it doesn't work so simple. Like, they just don't stand outside saying, come sign up. You can drive today. No, to be a trucker, number one, you got to know how to drive a truck. Okay. Most people don't know how to drive a truck. Number two, you have to complete such and such hours all this practice there's no sort of practice with uber there's no midternship there's you can even sign up with uber on your computer and you don't even have to talk to another person okay to be a trucker they want to make sure you're okay to drive they want to make sure that you know you have more than just a heartbeat they want to make sure that you can can get there on time they want to make sure they don't care about ratings you know this isn't like a five star rating Oh, you took a wrong turn. Oh, navigation error. You know, no. So it's really hard to compare the two because the expenses definitely vary. Truckers have a lot more expenses, but truckers also can make a whole lot more money than a freaking Uber driver, okay? And driving 11 hours straight in one direction is a whole lot easier driving 11 hours in freaking circles and 11 hours of driving around the block stopping impeding traffic waiting for someone to get in the car you know figuring out their address getting out of the car putting their bags in the trunk like it's really hard to compare the two but anyway guys if you like this video hit the thumbs up if you're a trucker hit the thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this subscribe anyway guys Thanks for watching. Peace. That's a wrap.